Worldwide Wrestling fans, J.D. Sloan here for WrestleTopia TV, bringing you the Star Spangled Spectacular 2018. You see in the ring currently, Nate Wilde taking on the fan favorite, LT Falk. LT, this is the first time in this area in MSWA. LT, second generation wrestler, son of a, the Memphis legend, Tony Falk. And what a hot night it is in Rockwood, Tennessee. MSWA Championship Wrestling. This is the first match of the evening. In this jam-packed building. Referee checking LT Falk, making sure there's no foreign objects in his, in his attire. He's just happy to be here in the building. Starting off shaking. Nate Wilde asking the fans if they're ready to get wild or not. Capacity crowd here in Rockwood, Tennessee. Lock up with a go behind by LT. Nate twisting himself out of that. LT looking for a counter. Into an arm lock. Wild rolling himself out. Reversal on LT Falk. LT spinning out into a leg sweep. LT on top with a headlock now. Capacity crowd excited for this evening. An evening we'll see Cowboy versus Cowboy, Kira Hogan. LT into the ropes. A block. Into a, into a pin in combination. One. Just a one count on that. Arm drag by LT. Arm drag now by Wild. Sweep of the leg. Cover only a one count. Both guys seem evenly matched here. The fans showing appreciation. A let's get wild chant now. Let's get wild. Let's get wild. Both men showing some mutual respect. Lock up. LT with the wrist lock. Squeezing in and turning it. LT in control. Oh, look at this maneuver. And a drop kick. What a maneuver by Wild. Two count. Oh, knife is chopped. They heard that in Knoxville. What a shot by Nate Wilde and LT not looking happy about it. The fans are loud. In this opening match of the Star Spangled Spectacular 2018. Oh, and a chop right back to Wilde from LT. A little tit for tat on that. Shoulder block now. Another shoulder block. Oh, big knee to the back and wrenching on the head of, of Wild. LT looking to get a little frustrated right now. Oh, big clothesline on a, on a down Wild and a two count. Oh, wait a minute, LT. LT not happy with the fans all of a sudden. Into a reversal to a schoolboy and a, just a two count. LT, forearms to the neck. Wild on, the, on, the, on his knees now, looking the worst for wear. LT in control, look at this. The vicious side of LT Falk coming out now. 
20 year veteran in LT. LT's been in the ring since he was a child. He knows all the tricks of the trade. LT Fox putting all of his body weight now onto the, the elbow and the shoulder of Wild. Oh, wait a minute. A little bit of jealousy coming out from LT. I don't think he's happy with the fans' response now. The fans behind Wild, and I don't think LT's too happy with that. This clothesline. Wild rolling off the back of LT. Big drop kick. Huge drop kick by Wild into the turnbuckles. Irish rip reversal by LT. LT setting them up. Running in. Nobody home. Oh, a big boot by LT. Could have knocked the man out right there. Cover. Wait a minute, LT's feet on the ropes. The referee didn't see LT cheating out a win. LT coming out, showing some mutual respect, shaking hands, kissing babies in mid-match. Got frustrated and turned on the fans. And the fans turning on LT. The winner of the first match, the questionable win, LT fought. Second match of the evening, and you hear the fans already in the ring. Listen to the fans on their feet for Aiden Brady. Rockwood, Tennessee's own Aiden Brady coming out to a a house full of cheers while his opponent, Drew Game, not loved at all in this area. Listen to those fans make the noise. Drew Game and his manager, Daddy Mac, the despicable Daddy Mac. Listen to the fans. Listen to those fans make the noise, shaking the whole building. You see Daddy Mac jaw jacking with all the fans. Oh, wait a minute. Not quite the response. Drew Game not getting quite the response Aiden Brady did. Referee for the contest, senior referee Doug Markham. And you're watching the Star Spangled Spectacular 2018 on WrestleTopia TV. In this jam-packed, sold-out, standing room only event. Drew Game with the boot, no lockup, but a boot back by Aiden. Drew Game plays some tricks now. Trying to play some mind games, getting in the head of the head of Aiden Brady. Daddy Mac consoling Drew. The despicable Daddy Mac. Hip toss. Into the ropes. Oh. A flying knee. Aiden well aware of Daddy Mac on the outside. These fans are hot for Aiden Brady. Aiden now on the outside going after Daddy Mac. Oh, and a clothesline to Drew Game right back to the outside. Aiden chasing Daddy Mac everywhere. On his knees crawling through the ring. And he's got a hold of him. But Drew Game is up from behind. Drew grabbing the face of Aiden Brady. Lucky for Drew. Aiden preoccupied with Daddy Mac. Now Drew's in control. 
has that knee right on the back of the head. Look at him pulling back on the face and the mouth, and now the nose of Aiden Brady taking, taking full advantage of that five count. Aiden, Bra Aiden Brady in trouble on his knees, trying to make his way back to his feet. Oh, look at this bridge. The strength that it takes to do something like that now, right back up. Drew Game. Hip toss. Another hip toss. Oh, drop kick now to the midsection. Drew Game rolling to the outside, trying to take a breather. Look at Aiden Brady. Full control. The fans solidly behind Aiden. This is awesome chance breaking out now. The referee counting Drew Game now. With a three count. You hear it, someone called him a chicken. Drew Game on the outside now. Bring, I'm sorry, Aiden Brady bringing Drew Game right back in. Oh, lucky cheap shot by Drew. Drew took that right hand to the chin, taking advantage of it. And look at the referee trying to get him to, to break that hold. That's an illegal hold on the bottom row. The fans chanting for Aiden. Look at Daddy Mac on the outside, loving everything he sees. Chin breaker, could this be what Aiden needs? Aiden back to his feet, clothesline. Shoulder block. Whoa. Huracan Rana now. Aiden Brady back in control. Head full of steam. Double knees. Belly to belly, look at that beautiful belly to belly. Drew's calling it. Or Aiden Brady's calling it. He says it's gonna be over. Aiden in the opposite corner. Running, double knees again. Another belly to back. The second one just as beautiful as the first. Roundhouse kick in the midsection now. Into the ropes. Oh! Went for a neck breaker. Drew held on to the ropes. Made on the ropes. And, no! Second match of the night. And listen to the fans. The fans are not happy. Second match of the night. Look at Daddy Matt. I can't believe it. the second match of the night. Both matches won by the wrong man with the foot on the rope. Aiden Brady has a full tank of gas left. Officially, the winner of the match, Drew Game. And MSWA just got a hundred times hotter. You see Impact Megastar Kira Hogan making her way to the ring. The fans are excited to see her. Kira Hogan, wow! Three years into the business, and you hear the fans excited to see her. Kira Hogan, trained by the legendary Mr. Hughes at the Hughes Academy. 
like I said, three years into the business, already a big star traveling the world. And women's champion fantasy now coming out. The last time WrestleTopia TV was here in Rockwood, we saw fantasy in a hardcore women's match. Tonight, Kira is going to be testing her technique. Kira currently wrestling with some of the the most technical wrestlers in the world, traveling all over, going up against the likes of second generation wrestlers and stardom wrestlers. This should be quite the contest for fantasy. Could be the match of the night. Fantasy rolling into the ring. Rockwood fans very familiar with this young lady. Remember, you're watching MSWA Championship Wrestling on WrestleTopia TV. Make sure you get on Facebook, check out MSWA, all their upcoming events. And don't forget WrestleTopia TV with the back library of this company. Matt starting out with a handshake. about fantasy blaming the ref perhaps perhaps getting in the head of Kira Hogan oh and Kira Hogan not happy with the slaps to the buttocks oh wait a minute look at fantasy a quick roll up by fantasy trying to take advantage of that second match to start out with a handshake and things seem to be going aware. Kira Hogan has to be careful on her toes, if you will. Lock up now. Kira grabbing a hold of the wrist, gonna try and wrench it out. Putting that pressure on the wrist and the elbow now. Fantasy probably going to try and roll out of this, and she does. Into a reversal. Fantasy really wrenching. Fantasy with control now. Kira Hogan getting herself out of that. Going into a front face lock. Really wrenching it in now. Both ladies up to their feet. Kick to the midsection by Fantasy. Kira Hogan looking for an opening. Fantasy with a headlock. Looks like she's really wrenching it in. Oh! Feet on the ropes now. Move about to be broken. Fantasy back up to her feet. Kira Hogan slowly making her way. Kira Hogan getting the fans to start clapping. The fans are hot tonight in this slam pack sold out arena. Kira Hogan now into a headlock. Kira Hogan really wrenching it in there. Squeezing on the ears and the temples. Headlock takeover into a scissors now. Feet on the bottom rope. Fantasy breaking the hold.
Both women circling. Went for a lockup. Fantasy grabbing the arms. Knee to the midsection. Oh, big suplex now. Big suplex. Fantasy with a handful of hair. Picking Kira back up to her feet. Fantasy with a right hand. And another right hand. Kira Hogan in trouble now. Ten minutes remain in the match. Kira Hogan kicks to the midsection. Building up some momentum. Oh, big splash. Building up some more momentum. And a big butt splash. Oh, look at that. Baseball slide into the face of Fantasy. Fantasy in trouble on the outside. Kira Hogan following. Both ladies on the outside. Oh. Into the mat. Kira Hogan, handful of hair, rolling Fantasy back in. Kira Hogan following into the ring. Could be a pinfall. One, two, only a two count. Uh, hook of the legs. Oh, now only a one count. Kira Hogan could be getting frustrated. Kira Hogan grabbing the arm, wrenching up on that shoulder, twisting the neck. Look at the pain of Fantasy's face. Kira Hogan in control. You see Fantasy itching her way to the ropes, making the hole broken. Referee Keyshawn Morris on top of it. Big kick to the back now. Kira breaking the hold, the referee right on top of that. Oh! Into a pinball, hook of a leg. Only a two count. No hook this time. Another pinball, still a two count. Kira Hogan getting to be frustrated. Wrenching on the hair of Fantasy now. Grabbing a hold of the arm. All that weight of Kira Hogan right on top of the top of the arm, pulling out on the shoulder. Fantasy slowly making her way up to her feet, grabbing a hold of the legs now. Looks like she's going into a Boston Crab. And she does. Oh, look at her. Wrenched all the way back. Look at the, the back of Kira Hogan. Kira in pain now. She's slowly making her way to the bottom rope. Fantasy letting go. Both women showing signs of frustration. Both women back to their feet now. Sweep of the leg into the middle of the ring. Leg drop into a pin. Only a two count. Oh, look at this submission maneuver now. Wrenching back on the chin, pulling back on the, the, the lower neck and the top of the shoulders. Just wrenching it all the way back. Again, broken hold by Fantasy. A lot of frustration now on the part of Fantasy. Hogan in trouble, the fans behind Hogan though, you hear a Hogan chant. Ten minutes have elapsed, five minutes remaining in the contest. Another pinfall, hook of the leg, still just a two count. What does Fantasy have to do to put Hogan down? What a match. Both women on their feet now. Kira fighting back though. 
Kira back to her feet now. Oh, man. Crescent kick right to the chin. Kira, fantasy rolling herself out. Can't be pinned if you're on the outside. Kira's going to have to go after her. Kira Hogan going after fantasy on the outside. Both women worse for wear. Kira actively stalking her. Oh, forearm by Fantasy, knocking Kira back. Setting her up, another forearm by Fantasy. Kira in trouble on the outside, the referee counting. Kira back in the ring. Miscounted, letting Fantasy get back in when it should have been a 10 count. Kira Hogan hooking the leg. One, two. I thought that was it, only a two count. Kira Hogan thought it was it too. Two minutes remaining in the match. If a pinfall is going to happen, it's going to have to happen soon. Fantasy giving it to her. Oh, man. Huge slap to the chest by Fantasy. Another chop. Kira Hogan in trouble. Oh, Kira Hogan giving it right back to Fantasy. Oh. Snapmare. What's Kira looking for? Kira's looking for an armbar. Kira with that armbar in the middle of the ring. Fantasy far away from the, ro the ropes. Will this be it? Kira wrenching back, pulling all the way back. One minute remaining in the contest. Something's gonna have to happen. Fantasy trying to pull herself out. Kira pulling her farther into the middle of the ring. I think this is gonna be it. Really wrenching in on it. I don't know how much longer. Fantasy can hold on. Something needs to happen. There's only seconds left remaining in the contest. Seconds remaining in the contest. Something has to happen. Kira Hogan. Go up. Look at this reversal. This is going to be it. She's going to. Looking for the rope. Fantasy doing everything she can. remaining that's it time has run out you hear time has run out the fans chanting they think Kira is the winner Official standings of the match is a time limit draw. The fans are not happy about it. Listen to the fans still in the record books, walking away, woman's champion. Fantasy. Fantasy looking for a handshake and a hug. Mutual respect. Fantasy holding her arm. She knows this young lady, Kira Hogan, took her to the limit. Barely escaping with a time limit draw.
Official, official decision of the match is a time limit draw. All right, wrestling fans, fourth match of the evening. We see the hated Ray Fury on his way out to the ring. The fans not taking the Ray Fury at all. MSWA Championship Wrestling, Star Spangled Spectacular 2018, coming to you from the hot Rockwood, Tennessee. Fourth match of the evening. This should be a wild one, fast paced, hard hitting. Currently in the ring with the referee, Ray Fury. Listen, the fans don't like Ray Fury at all. Waiting for his opponent to come out. Checking Matt Gilbert, making sure there's no foreign objects hidden away. Turning to his opponent. You hear the bell, the match is underway. Listen to those fans. The fans are hot and loud in this jam packed Rockwood, Tennessee arena. Woo! 
Can we start out with a handshake? No. Ray Fury not looking to show any kind of mutual respect. Absolute incredible night so far of action. Both men circling each other, lock up. Jockeying for position now. Fury with an arm. Some chain wrestling. Headlock takeover. Fury with the headlock in control, both men back up to their feet. Really wrenching it in. Gilbert found a way out of it though. Extending the hand, Fury not interested. Into a wrist lock. Really wrenching it in, not gonna let him roll out of it. Gilbert not letting Fury roll out of the wrist lock. Fury's got to figure out some other way. Down to the knee. Fury figuring something out, rolling out. Oh, arm drag. Matt Gilbert with an arm drag. Fury trying to roll out of that wrist lock, getting caught. Oh, Gilbert trying to extend the hand again and Fury just spinning in it. Clothesline miss. Slap to the face on Gilbert. Roll up now, Fury with just a one count. Gilbert on top of Fury now. Fury kicking out of that. Oh, man! Forearm shot from Gilbert onto Fury. Rocking Fury. Fury in the corner trying to think of his plan, maybe needing to change some things up. Fury, Gilbert with a monkey flip on the Fury. Fury trying to jump out of it. Catching him with the shoulder. Now, a, oh! Fury trying for the monkey flip. Gilbert holding on to the ropes. I think it could be going into slingshot. Top rope, oh! Big clothesline, big elbow. Iris rip into the corner. Big back body drop. Fury got all kind of air on that. Gilbert looking out to the crowd. The crowd showing some appreciation. Gilbert, what's he going for? Oh, a plunger to the outside. to the outside from Gilbert on the Fury. Listen to those Gilbert chants. Both men back in the ring now. Hey. Oh! Gilbert missing. Fury catching the feet. Oh my God! Slinging Gilbert on the back of his head. That could have caused a concussion. I mean, total force slinging him onto the back of the head from the ropes. Fury now kicking to the back of the neck. Snap mare whip. Off the ropes, elbow to the back of the neck. Into a cover, Fury, one, two, only a two count, Fury covering to Gilbert, still something left in Gilbert's tank, look at this, modified choke with his legs, trying to put Gilbert to sleep now. Fans letting Fury know how they feel about him. 
Fury kicking out and standing up and kicking the back of Gilbert's head. Rolling him up, hooking the legs. One, two. Only a two count. Gilbert still with fight left in him, though. Fury looking pissed. Pulling Gilbert back to his feet. Oh man! Big open hand slap to the face by Gilbert. Roundhouse kick though by Fury. And a crescent kick to the side of the face. Fury back with another pin attempt. Two! Only a two count. Both men working their ass off in this match. Fury up to his feet. Gilbert in the middle of the ring, trying to pull himself up. Axe hand to the back of the head. Fury, big scoop slam. Into the turnbuckle, second rope now. Oh, a big leg drop from the second rope. Is this it? Just a two count. Just a two count. Gilbert really taking a beating at this point. The fans still solidly behind Gilbert, but he's been taking punishment for a long period of time now. Gaining momentum into a into a sleeper. The referee needing to check and make sure it's not a choke. Listen to these fans. Looks like they're going up for a suplex. Gilbert down to his knees though. Right into the kidney. You see Fury trying to, wait Gilbert, he's trying to stop this. Look, oh, front place plant by Gilbert. Into the ropes now. Drop down, drop kick. Into the back of the head of Fury. Gilbert trying everything he can to come back. This might be his one and only opportunity. Fury stopping him though. Oh! Short arm splash! That was it! Only a two count. I thought for sure that was all she wrote. I don't know if I was Gilbert, I don't know if I'm gonna keep kicking out after the beating that he's taken for the last five, six minutes. 
Fury pulling Gilbert by his chin. Look at the despicable face on Fury. Knee to the chest. Gilbert up and over. Oh! Reverse neck breaker. Giving Gilbert going for a pin. One, two. Only a two count. Gilbert doing everything he possibly can. Everything he possibly can do. The fans still behind Gilbert. I don't know what's left in this man. The last five, six minutes straight, Fury has just been taking him apart piece by piece. Fury back to his feet first. Gilbert now back to his feet. Missing a clothesline. Oh, look at Gilbert almost out of the ring. Another kick. Both men in the corner. Gilbert whipping him off. Big splash into a forearm. Flying forearm by Gilbert. Belly to belly. A cover. One, two. Oh, Gary barely with the shoulder up. Both men have to be absolutely spent. It's 100 degrees in this building. Both men sweating profusely, giving everything they can in the middle of the ring. I can't believe Gilbert is still standing. Gilbert now pulling Fury back to his feet. Fury, forearm shot to Gilbert. One right back. Back and forth, both men trading shots. Gilbert getting the best of it though. Oh. Fury putting a stop to it with a knee to the chest. Fury off the ropes. Oh, big drop on Fury by Gilbert. Wait a minute. Fury putting a big stop to that. Oh, a big stomp onto the chest by Fury onto Gilbert. Listen to the fans in unison cheering on Matt Gilbert. All that heart, all that time rehabbing, coming back from that, that injury. Ray Fury picking Gilbert up. Gilbert with an elbow to the side of the head, missing with the kick. Fury with a kick to the chest. Oh my God! Big Michinoku driver. That's it. Fury on top. One, two. And Gilbert kicks out. I will say that was a lackadaisical cover by Fury. But I thought for sure that was going to be it. There was a bell. What was the bell? I don't know what the bell was. Wait a minute. They're awarded Fury the championship. The fans not happy. I must have missed the three count. Awarding the championship to Fury. We have a new MSWA TV champion, and it's Ray Fury, taking it from Matt Gilbert. The official winner of the match, Ray Fury. The fifth match of the night, the MSWA championship match. There we see Knuckles, the one-time bodyguard of that man right there, Daddy Mac. Two despicable men in the middle of the ring. One of them holding the championship. His opponent, the former champion, You hear the music?
music. I guarantee quite the ovation for this man coming out. the people at home. A rake to the eye. Into the corner, no. A reversal by John. All of his body weight now on Knuckles. That's as quick as it is. And look, Daddy Mac on the ring skirt. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Brass Knuckles on Knuckles. Two, three! We have a new 
new champion. We have a new MSWA champion. Big Mac John. New champion. You heard the crowd going absolutely crazy. What is going on now? Daddy Mac telling the referee to check John. Wait a minute. Those were the brass knuckles that Knuckles had. Wait a minute. These two slime buckets. because of a reverse decision. You see, wait a minute, what is going on? This is garbage. These despicable men. Real proud of yourselves. Champion Knuckles! Promoter Ox Harley now with the microphone.
favorites here at MSWA Championship Wrestling. making noise for these men. Helping the young man back into the ring. We might 
finally be getting some order in this match. Quick tag now by J-Mac. And a, and a punch right to the bicep of Esteban. Quick tag now to Cody Morton. Back to the top rope. Oh, and a stomp onto the, the elbow and the bicep. Reverse nice fed chop. Irish rip into the corner. Cody Morton. Forearm to the side of the face. Esteban in all kinds of trouble. Just a one count. Morton right back on top of him. Finally, two men in the middle of the ring. Quick tags on this team of Morton and Free Dreams. Tags win tag team matches. Another quick tag. The cartel in all kinds of trouble now. Double team maneuver by Sweet Dreams. Double elbow. Going for a pin. One, two. Oh, only a one count. You see Los Chicanos grabbing the referee to break the count. Really just giving it to Esteban now. J-Mac Murray in control in the middle of the ring. You gotta think not how the cartel wanted this match to go this early. And a tag to one of, one of the Los Chicanos. Into the ropes. Big boot to the face. Going for a cover. Two count. Cody Morton making his way into the ring. Boot to the knee. Off the ropes. Oh, a frog, a standing frog splash by Los Chicano. Only a two count. have changed now in this match. J-Mac really needed to make a tag. Oh my God. Absolutely disgusting. Just spinning on the man. No tag was made. Unfortunately though, the referee's back was turned. J-Mac in the middle of the ring in serious trouble now. Back up to his feet. Elbow to the side. J-Mac trying to beat his way out. Throwing forearms to the side of, of Esteban. Trying to get him to release the hold, but pulling him right back into the corner of the cartel. Cody Morton now getting the referee's attention, unfortunately. Trying to come in to help his tag team partner, but unfortunately it backfired. And a, and a two count, almost a three count on that. Chicanos, they're not light men. One of Sweet Dreams jumping in to break up the, the penitent. J Mac in the, in the cartel's corner. The team of Sweet Dreams and Cody Morton, they need to do something quickly. I don't know how much longer J Mac has. What he's got left in him. Boot to the midsection. J-Mac trying to fight his way out of this corner. 
rolling underneath and attack to Cody Morton. Cody Morton, a house of fire. Big jump kick. And a belly to back suplex. Morton going for the pin. Only a two count. Esteban pulling Morton to the outside now. Running him into the guardrail. Or, I'm sorry, into the ring post. You see, most Chicano in the ring. Pulling the referee's attention. Just putting the boost to Cody Morton in the corner. Esteban tagged in now. Just working on the back of the neck of Cody Morton. That two count. Cody Morton in trouble now. Look at a submission maneuver. Almost looks like a cross face. Really wrenching back on the head. Esteban trying to draw in the opposition. To gain the, the attention of the referee. Just tearing apart Cody Morton. Kicks to the midsection. Gaining some momentum and a miss. Cody Morton rolling out. Can he make a tag? And he did. Forearm after forearm. Clothesline now, clothesline. An axe handle to the back of the head, breaks the count. Thrown to the outside. Cody Morton with the jump kick. Wait a minute. Oh, a big back body drop and double super kicks. This could be it. Almost a three count. Tandem super kicks to the head. Cody Morton moving out of the way. Cody Morton moving out of the way. Jamek, super kick after super kick. Oh, and a spear. A big spear. Two, three. Listen to this building a rock. A spear and then a three count. Your winners, the team of Sweet Dreams and Cody Morton. Ox Harley making all kinds of matches for next month, August 11th, back to school event. We'll see Cody Morton taking on Drago, Sweet Dreams taking on Los Chicanos. wrestling fans, the main event of the evening. Years in the making here in East Tennessee. Many promotions have tried, but it's here at MSWA Championship Wrestling. Tonight is the night we see Cowboy versus Cowboy.
actions mix for this young man. One time for love. Now somewhat hated. Accompanied by the despicable Daddy Mac. The Cadillac Cowboy, his biggest challenger to date. And we await his opponent. You hear the fans saying it with the theme music. Sorry about your damn luck. Match. It's, 
Is Steve Burns doing his stretching now? I don't know what he's doing on the outside. He's spending a lot of time arguing with fans. Storm not letting Steve Burns back in the ring. I don't know if Steve Burns just expects to, to get in without any uh, opposition from, from James Storm. Oh, and from behind. He was looking for that opening and he took it. Just pounded away at James Storm. Storm in the corner. Oh, and look at that. Storm fighting back now. Both men really going at it. Cadillac Cowboy with a choke on Storm in the corner. Right hand to the head. Giving it to the boots to him now. Look at Steve Burns. And you see Daddy Mac on the outside cheering his man on. A, a stomp to the foot. Big right hand. Storm getting wobbly, raked to the back. Then another big right hand by Steve Burns. And a choke. Cadillac Cowboy really taking it too. Oh, and Storm, right as I was about to say that, Storm fighting back. Oh, just threw him halfway across the ring. Nothing but pure power on that. Up and over. Storm ducking a clothesline. Oh. Uh-oh. Storm calling for a super kick. Burns rolling to the outside, though. Daddy Max fanning him off. Could this be it? No, 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 no. Burns knew that was coming, rolled to the outside. James Storm truly looking to be in incredible shape. Look at Daddy Mac and, and Steve Burns trying to come up with a better game plan. What they've been doing has not been working. Both men back in the ring. Circling each other. Storm really, Storm really giving Steve Burns some trouble. It's like Burns doesn't really know how to deal with him. What? Raising his hands on the outside, you haven't won anything. You see, senior referee Doug Markham trying to get Steve Burns back in the ring. This time, James Storm now on the outside. I don't think Burns knows what, who it is. He thinks it's the ref. Oh, a big right hand by James Storm. Cowboy crawling on the outside. Oh. Burns trying to figure out where to go. James Storm making someone's night tonight. And another fan. If you're watching this on WrestleTopia TV, I hope you're having a great time. But if you're not here live, you don't get to do things like that. Remember, support your local independent wrestling. Buy a ticket, be there live. James Storm, bring him, bring him back in the ring. Cadillac in all kinds of trouble, rolling back to the outside. Steve Burns sneaking in now.
control now, finally figuring out a game plan that's going to work. Oh. Grabbing the hair of Storm, bring him to the back, onto the mat, to the back of his head. Barnes in control. James Storm in trouble. Burns just right hand after right hand. Both men now to the outside. Big boot to the head of Storm. Oh. Burns just reverse Michael chop and now a right hand. Burns is just stalking Storm. What's he about to do? Storm back to his feet now. Oh my God! Oh! There are no crash pads on the outside of this ring. That was solid concrete. Hip toss on James Storm on the solid concrete. Storm in the, I'm sorry, Cadillac Cowboy in the middle of the ring. The referee making a count on Storm. I don't know if Storm can get back in the ring or not. You hear the fans? There's a Storm chant now. Steve Burns rolling to the outside. He's going to be breaking the count as he jumps on Storm. Storm barely making it to his feet. Uh-oh, what's he about to do? Burns telling the fans to move out of the way. Move to the head of James Storm. Had the fans move out of the way. Beating the back of James Storm. Come on. Oh no! Reverse! Head of Cowboy in the chair! James Storm reversed that Irish rip and sent the Cadillac Cowboy in the chair! You hear the fans! Storm grabbing the leg of Cowboy in a right hand, bringing him back in the ring.
Look at Steve Burns just disrespecting James Storm. Burns pulling Storm back up to his feet. Still both men on the outside. Burns rolling Storm back. Wait a minute. Half body in, half body out. What's Burns about to do? And he misses! He was going for a leg drop on the, the, the uh, ring apron and he misses! Storm moving out of the way. Storm on his knees trying to make his way back up to his feet. Steve Burns back in the ring, on up to his feet first. Trade and blows now. Storm. Irish whip. Reversal. Storm flying off the rope. Atomic drop. Big close line. Storm looks to have a second win. Up and over. Oh, it's a bird in the back of the net. Burns with boots to, the, to Storm. Oh, and stomping on the hands again. Burns going to the outside. What's he looking for? Burns with a steel chair. Rolling back to the ring. I don't know if Doug Mark is going to let this fly or not. Trouble Burns with a chair. Steve Burns setting that chair up in between the top and the second row. Setting something up. Going after Storm. Storm with a boot to the face. A second boot to the face. Oh, power slam. And a cover. Two, three. Only a two count. James Storm kicks out. Milliseconds away from a three count. Steve Burns is many seconds away from perhaps the biggest win of his entire career. something to Daddy Mac. I don't know what Daddy Mac's looking for. Look at another chair. Wait a minute. And he's going after. And he misses. He misses with the chair. Almost a three count. He went to swing the chair. Storm. Storm moves out of the way. Burns hitting the top rope, smacking himself back with the chair. Burns going back to that chair between the top and the middle rope. He's 
stalking Storm in the corner. Storm on wobbly legs and all kinds of trouble. James Storm in serious trouble at this point. The Cadillac Cowboy looks to be taking away this win. Form. Oh, chin breaker. Into the ropes. Missed out of no, Doug Markham. Storm just hit referee Doug Markham. Doug is down. The ref is down. Cowboy behind him. Wait a minute, Daddy back now. Reversal. There's no referee to count. There's no referee to count. Doug Markham in serious trouble on the ground. Storm back up to his feet. Oh man, head first into the chair. A head of steam and head first into the chair. That's it. Doug Markham's up, that's it. Two. That's all over. And a Storm kicks out. Storm kicks out. Look at the face of Cadillac Cowboy. He doesn't know what to think. Head first into a chair and he still kicks out. Steve Burns with a handful of hair of Storm. Wait a minute, Daddy Mac. What does he have? Powder. Storm moves out of the way. Super kick. Super kick. One, two, three. the match, James Storm. This is J.D. Storm for WrestleDopia TV. Tonight, you saw one hell of a night of wrestling action. MSWA Championship Wrestling. Remember, support your local wrestling, and I'll see you next time.